We are in paradise right now. I live here. I have grandparents that are not even a mile away from here. Yeah, this is our town. My mom was born and raised here. I guarantee I'm gonna drive by it later. Seeing the whole process of paradise bouncing back from the campfire, it's, it's nice to be a part of it. We really wanna bring back the environmental beauty of paradise. It was, it was sort of heartbreaking to watch that. And you know, hearing you know, my grandparents, they might not have their home and all the memories we had there. It was, it was scary. I've been out here for four years. I saw from the burn to growth, this is an absolute necessity. Our requirement was to make sure that it was planted in an area that was beneficial to the salmon. This being a tributary to, I believe, Little Butte Creek, which leads to Butte Creek. We're on a hillside out here clearing and planting trees. Perfect. We have a few types of trees we're planting today. Big leaf maple. There's black oak. Live oak. Oregon ash. And we have a Douglas fir. We're definitely putting in some trees that are gonna be better for fire protection and fire resiliency as well. My partner uses his rake to scrape away to the raw dirt and I come in and put a tree next to the flag and we move on and then the people come behind us and they plant the trees. I've never seen one in my life until I started working here. They called a hoedad. It's pretty much just a spade that's elongated. You just scoop it in, it pulls the dirt back and you can just slip the plant right in. It takes like 30 seconds to plant a tree. And then put paper and dirt over around the trees to protect them. Protect the plant. You know, when I hear 15 acres for the work that we do, it is, it's always impressive to see the efficiency, the end results from when we started to when we end. I would say the community impact of planting the trees is kind of, I guess, a little hope. It's nice to just be out here just planting trees, you know, it does feel good. It brings a sense of pride.